Welcome to this uh, video about algebra, about constructing equations. And it's really a beautiful question um, because it involves, um, or you need to apply your understanding of perimeter, of area, of, of algebra. So it's really a lot uh, that you'll be tested upon. This, by the way, is a past paper question. So all credit goes to Cambridge examinations. Um, and one of you asked me on my site, expandingmaths.com, to help with this particular question, yeah? So you can do the same thing. Go to my site, check out all my resources, uh, and if you still have questions, you can ask me there too. Now, let's have a look what is going on. Um, I just typed it over, so this, again, this is a past paper question. It said, a farmer makes a rectangular enclosure for his animals. And um, I made this sketch, and this is part of the, the question, yeah? So on your exam paper, they make a, a proper uh, drawing for you. Uh, a rectangular enclosure for his animals, yeah? So a piece of land with some grass so the cows and sheep or whatever can, um, you know, walk around and eat the grass. He uses a wall for one side, yeah? So there's a wall on one side because he doesn't want his animals to go in all directions, yeah? So there's a wall which will stop them. And he uses a wall from one side and a total of, you know, let me put a line underneath that, 72 meters of fencing, so 72 meters for the other three sides. So this plus this plus that is 72 meters. Yeah, that's important to realize. And this is a rectangle. That's what it said, a eh? rectangular enclosure. The enclosure, it says, has a width of X meters. And that was also already um, drawn for you in the, in the sketch. Um, and an area of A square meters. Yeah, so the area, a capital A meter square show that a yeah, so the area equals 72x minus 2x squared now again this was the entire question given to you i just copied it and uh, wrote it down because i cannot do the square while typing that's why i wrote it okay now what's going on yeah i have to show that the area equals 72x minus 2x squared now the area of an enclosure of this enclosure which is a rectangle will be the width times the length all right because that's the area of a rectangle width times the length. Now I know the width, which is x, but I don't know the length, yeah? So I can do two things now. I can say out loud, well, it's impossible, they made a mistake. Or I gotta somehow find out, do I know, or can I find the length? I know that these three sides together equal 72, yeah? And if I realize, and I should, that for a rectangle, the opposite sides are equal, so this side is also x, that makes the length 72 minus 2x. Do you agree with that? Yeah, because the entire length is 72. Take away x, take away x. That's going to be the length or, yeah, the length of this side of the rectangle. Yeah, and that is what you're doing when you're constructing equations. You're looking for the pieces of information, what you can use um, to construct those equations. All right, um, area then. So that's length times width. Uh, and by the way, that's that 72, eh? you see that? So that could have been a hint. So let me write down that the area is L times W. So that is X times, and let me put those brackets there. I don't want to make any silly mistakes. 72 minus 2X, okay? Now if I expand that, so I multiply all the terms inside the brackets by X, then I will get uh, 72x minus 2x squared. And look at that, that is what they told me. Show that, and I did show it, yeah? 72x minus 2x squared is the area of the enclosure. So, a beautiful question. It's about area, it's about perimeter, constructing equations. Check my website, guys. I have the entire IGCSE and GCSE curriculum online. I explain all the topics and videos. I have worksheets for you. Everything is for free. You can ask me questions as well. Like and share this video if it was useful. Okay, then I can help your friends too. And for the rest, I wish you a very pleasant day. Bye-bye.